art that's good enough to eat, edible sculpted <laughs> arrangements to new company that is giving people an extra special touch to their catering needs. Look, Look at the watermelons. Look. It's us. That's unbelievable. You know who did that? <laughs> Oba Rhodes. He is oh. the master carver, and he's adding his artistic touch to everything he does. And listen to this for Memorial Day. He will make his own massive project, a life-sized Iron Man made completely of produce. Oh, that's so good. We have to talk. Yes, we do. With the brain <laughs> bio. Okay, so Oba is here with his spokeswoman, Keisha, <laughs> his sister, his mom and his niece are here too. Welcome. Good to see you guys. Good to see you guys. So cool. So you're going to show us how you carve Oba right while yes. Keisha talks. Yes. How, how did Oba get into this, Keisha? Well, he just <laughs> have a love for art. Like, he's always loved it. It's his passion. Yeah. And so one day he just wanted to start carving things. He used other mediums, but he found that produce was like an excellent medium that he developed his skill and his technique and since then it's just been soaring okay okay so you're his sister you've been around this guy his whole life has, yes. has he always had this this artistic thing going for him is this something that he just sort of discovered one day how did it come to be he used to do other types of arts drawing painting different things like so that but here. starting in November he said hey I'm gonna carve food he started with a mango and then behold months later this is what developed so, so he is carving, and I, I mean, if you look at this collection of carving instruments, these are not yes. the Ginsu knives. <laughs> did he, did these he, are like, that is a serious set of knives. Is that a, a toolkit of his own making? No, he actually, he used other things too, but that's yeah. the basics. But I don't know, like he kind of did develop the skill with it. How long did it's, it take to go from just starting out to being able to put a, like a person's likeness, and it really looks like us over on a watermelon? He's really fast, as you can see, like with carving a fish, he's really, really fast. So it takes just You're a matter right. of hours. Yeah, see? Um, yeah. Look, it looks just like I can't yes. see it. It's just, it's, it's. <laughs> <laughs> it is really fast. Though. Yeah, it's really, really, really fast. Uh, I know you don't want a microphone in your face while you were working, but I gotta, <laughs> I, gotta, I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta come over here anyway. Now, when you're doing something like this, for instance, you obviously looked at, at some of our headshots to put those together. Mm -hmm, How mm -hmm. long does it take you to go from looking at something like that to making something like well, that? Well, I have sort of a photographic memory. I look at it, oh. I get it, a picture in my head, and yeah. then I get that picture and I put the visual onto the watermelon approximately about two hours or so because I got to get the image on the watermelon and then I'm pretty much freehand the rest but I have to have the picture as a reference and I just Neat. go to town. Oh but uh, yeah. when you do this Memorial Day weekend Iron Man made of produce mm -hmm. where mm -hmm. are you going to do this and when and how can people see it? We are going to be at Washington Park. Awesome. Okay. Uh, yeah. I think the time starts at three o'clock. Yes. Now, do you have it all figured out, like, which part of Iron Man is... is how many watermelons like, how will many I take? Is it watermelons? <laughs> is it other produce? Like, wh how are you going to do this? We're going to incorporate the red of the watermelon for the red parts of Iron Man. Yeah. And then we're going to take the butternut squash, and that's going to be the gold from the Iron Man. Oh, my goodness. So you're going to see, like, we're going to do an LED lights. We're going to have his eyes light up. His hands are going to light up. What? It's going to be very yes, fun it's for so kids. Awesome. Very yeah. fun for people. Awesome. <laughs> that does sound pretty awesome. Now let's say I'm having a party, all right? And I want yeah. to do something different. This is obviously a you know a catering situation as well as an artistic situation. Right. Mm -hmm. How do yes. we get a hold of you guys? How do we find you? What kind of events do you do? Well, you can find us on our Facebook. It's called ESC Creations. Um, directly from the Facebook, you'll have a link to the our website. Okay. Um, so you'll be able to reach us there. Our telephone number is 513-713-0122. And then you're on Instagram, too. And so we're on people Instagram. We're on Twitter. We're on YouTube. Yes. Turn that around, Oba, so we can show what you've made there. It's a fish. And it's a quick piece. I had to do it in two minutes, That's but okay. as you see, it is oh, a fish. Isn't that neat? <laughs> but look Show at it right there to that camera I mean, right look at there. these beautiful trays that Oba did, too. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I look mean, these, these are gorgeous. You give a man a fish, he, he eats for a day. You, you <laughs> caught the watermelon like a fish, he will eat for the rest of his life. <laughs> Oba, this was just amazing. Thank That's you so, so cool. much. Because yeah, I know that took you a lot of time yeah. to put yeah. us on watermelons. You're and I can, I can safely you. say none of us has ever been on a watermelon. <laughs> first one. First yeah. time. <laughs> it's going to be the first time for Iron Man, too. That's yeah. cool. It's never been done before. Memorial first. Day weekend, Washington Park, 3 o'clock on Memorial Day. Yes. yes. Monday. Come right. see us, everybody. Come give a little support. It's going to be a lot of other activities to do fun for kids. All right. Yes. Let's send it over to Tara. Find out what the weather's going to be like this weekend. Oh, look. Oh, there's yeah. the other one. <laughs>
Oh, that's strong <laughs> directing upstairs right there. Move and I'll do the forecast as well. <laughs>